What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to apply various optimization tweaks to your rooted Galaxy S5 with a single build.prop edit. The build.prop file in an Android device is home to a bunch of system level values and settings. People have been editing these values to get new functionality and better performance since Android has existed. Well, XDA user Thayer Asad has compiled a great set of these build.prop tweaks for the Galaxy S5 that will optimize performance in various ways, from battery life to data connectivity and graphics rendering. I went ahead and threw these tweaks into a text file for easy sharing, and that can be found at the full tutorial. So head over to the link in the description below to download that text file, and we'll get started on applying it. First of all, you'll need a feature-rich root enabled file browser to make these changes. There are several free options available on the Play Store that will work for our purposes today, but the one I'll be demonstrating with is called FX File Explorer. It has a root add-on that you can also download for free on the Play Store, so be sure to have that installed as well before beginning. And if you have a different file browser that you prefer to use, the steps will be pretty much the same. Just make sure that it can edit text files. But anyway, the first step here is to head to that text file that you downloaded from the full tutorial. It'll be in your download folder, so dip in there and long press the file. From here choose Open With, then select Text Editor from the next menu. The actual tweaks in here will look a bit like gibberish, but each selection is labeled in plain English. So for instance, you can see that this first group of tweaks pertains to graphics acceleration. Go ahead and have a look through all of them, and if any of these individual groups look like something you don't care to apply, you can delete the corresponding entries. With that all squared away, the next step is to copy all of this text. To do that, just hit the pencil shape button at the top of the screen and press select all. Then tap it again, and choose copy. Now you can just back out, and if it asks, choose discard changes. From here, head to FX's home screen and tap system root. If you haven't done so already, it'll ask for super user privileges at this point, so grant it those. Next, head to the System folder. Then at the top of the screen, press the lock icon to mount the folder Read Write. Now the only thing I don't like about FX is that it has an excessive amount of warning messages. But don't be scared off by any of this. Just tick I understand and press OK. Next, scroll down to the bottom of this folder and long press the build.prop file. Again, choose Open With, then Text Editor. Now just tap any part of the screen, then move the cursor to an empty line. It doesn't really matter where you put the cursor, it's just that we're about to paste all that text in here, and we don't want it to split one of those existing lines in half or something like that. So with that done, just hit the pencil button up top again, and this time choose Paste. All these cool tweaks were just added to the build.prop file, so now all we have to do is save our changes. So tap the three dot menu button up top and select Save. At this point, you can back out of the text editor and even exit FX. The only thing left to do now is to perform a reboot so that these changes will become active. And when you get back up, you should notice a nice boost in performance right away. But for more tips and tricks like this, be sure to check out our website over at GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.